Welcome back, my friends, to a special rousing rendition of Choir Boys Cutlery. Well, today's the day. Today is the day that, that we uh, have raffled off. We've already done the raffle. Um, there's no way to do it without me just screwing it up. I'll show you this. I use this. Uh, it's random.org. And if you look right here where my finger's at, that little box, that's how we did it. Chose it randomly. And the number 17 popped up. So lucky winner number 17. Now, some of this is pre-done. Of course, I should have just put it on top. So the winner of the raffle is... Please, Lord, don't look me backwards. Anita and Sweetheart, I cannot say your last name, but that's who it is. Um, I've already uh, been in contact uh, with them, and we've got an address, and it's somebody y'all know, uh, but I'll let them uh, make any kind of announcement they want to do now. Address is, it's probably the most important thing. So, if you have, why in the hell are you wearing sunglasses? Well, I deal with this about every video. Uh, I have a WAP eye, this eye right here. Now, it distracts me, so I know if it distracts me, it distracts the hell out of you. It's looking over there at this point. So I put these on, uh, and it makes me look cool. You know, 50-year-old fat guy sitting in his kitchen looking cool. The wooden spoon behind me, forking spoon behind me, uh, were my grandparents. Everywhere we go, they go with us. Uh, they will go to my son. That that And, and believe it or not, it's got like some tribal stuff on it. It's, I, I don't like a totem pole type thing. I don't even know where the hell it came from. Now, my granddaddy there ain't no telling, son. So that's a big thing. I don't know why I mean, well, I do know why I mentioned it. I looked at it. And, and it goes, it, here's what else it does. Because we're going to just slide off here for a second. It shows compromise. Most women would not put that in their kitchen. Megan, knowing what it means to me, Put it puts it up. It's the first thing that goes up no matter where we're at. But we've been together about 16 years now. And in, in the three homes that, that we've had, uh, they go in the kitchen. It's just, it's just the way it is. And I'm thankful to her for that. So there's a little big piece of history. Now, uh, I'm so excited. I'll get that board out to you, Anita. And I've got another thing coming up at the end of this video. I'll give you details on that. Now, the big part is, the big push is, the big thing is, we raffled off a board. You say, well, Scab, uh, what'd you do with the money? Good question. I'm glad you asked. Let me make sure. We uh, decided to send the Southeastern Guide Dogs and support them because they provide money, or they provide puppies, uh, comfort dogs, to veterans. So let me show you this. This is our receipt. None of my info's on that. Make sure you can see it good. And let me tell you something, guys. For everybody who participated, thank you from the bottom of my heart. We were able to give $250 for a YouTube channel that's under four months old. You guys trusted me. Uh, you sent money in. You've been supported, supportive. You've watched these videos. And, man, I'm telling you, I'm so appreciative. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. This is not the end, it's just the beginning. It is our desire here at Choir Boys Cutlery, and that's me and Megan, uh, to raise awareness. And, and, and I wanted to do more than that. See, I can get up here and talk for hours and hours. You're going, no, oh, no, that's right. That's just talk. But when we send in some money, it don't matter the amount. I know that's not a huge amount. We got 330 or 328 subscribers, dude. Under four months old. You guys rallied. You sent money to me. I don't even know the total we've sent in. I don't know if they'll tell me that. I need to email Miss Lisa and just see if we can get a round figure because I know some of you guys donated directly. Thank you again. I don't even know if everybody put on Choir Boys Cutlery. Um, this was a learning experience. That little clickety clack you hear is Lola walking through. She's not impressed. Um, but, it, but it's been a learning experience. And I am over the moon. I'm ecstatic, man. 
I, I don't know what $250 can do, but I know this, it does more than zero. And so thank you again from the bottom of my heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And if you're a veteran and you're watching this, you just staggered across this thing. We care about you. It's not about the board. It's not about the raffle. It's not about old scab. It's about you. We care. Somebody cares. Now, I want y'all to know, I know. I don't know in the, in the big scope of things, we're an nth of an nth of a millionth of a fraction, but doing a dent. But it is my desire. It is my prayer. It is my goal. That if not in my lifetime, in my grandson's lifetime, that we bring that number to zero. I say we collectively. There's all kind of project Mahala, Mission 22. There's all kind of people that are involved in this. So and, and dude, they're big money. They're big time. They're big, and and we're here. But but I'm gonna tell you something. I've never done anything in my life that I didn't do big, and I didn't do to grow, and I didn't do to, to build. Captain Electra did a jam up job a couple of weeks ago. He did a video on what, what it means to be successful on YouTube. Well, you know, being successful, what makes you happy? And I and I want to be su su successful here. Not for money. I got a good job. I'm blessed with a good job. Megan just got a, a, a new job and a big jump and and we're excited and we're blessed. But getting this message out, and, and the truth is, man, I had a blast with this channel. Dude is fun. I get to run around the woods and cut, cut shit up and, and test all kind of knives. I get to talk to you and y'all get to hear my melodious tones. So we're excited. So Anita, congratulations, sweetheart. So glad I, I'll get that board out to you. If not today, I think it just started raining. It'll be tomorrow, but I'll get it out to you. I hope, I hope you enjoy it. Hey, and to Sean Crawford, thank you again. I've got to check in on my boy Sean, make sure um, they're home. I don't know if they made it in from Atlanta yet, uh, but Sean, if you're watching, uh, man, we love you. Thank you. My video's tomorrow, probably today. I need to get a hold of Sean. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to post a link or something. I think he's got an Etsy page, and he does, uh, he does custom stuff. He's building some furniture and stuff. Now, listen to me. Don't go over here and ask for no discount, no deal. That, that wears me out. That shit burnt. That's like... People go to a tattoo, man, can you get a deal? Get out the shop. I hate that. Or you go to a bar and get get a, get a beer, you know, like your big bowler, big big bowler over there, you know, with your little tight pants on, did your little bench press workout there with your tight shirt, little Billy biceps, drink about it you know, fifty, sixty dollars because you wore the damn bartender out asking for dip and then tip five dollars. Get the hell out of the bar. I don't even know where that came from. Y'all know I'm about half crazy, so that that's where that came from. But I'm gonna put some links to Sean so y'all go in there and he can make you some nice stuff. So now we're gonna wrap this thing up because we got all kind of videos going. But this is about American made badassery or veterans are and you know what? Let me say this. Let me say this. I'm going to go vote today, too. I don't give a damn what party you vote for. I don't care. I really don't. I don't like any of them, but I'm going to go vote. I'm going to go vote because there's a lot of men and women who went out when nobody asked them to or when their country called and they didn't come home. Well, I ain't going to vote. It don't make a difference. Well, sit your ass at home and don't make videos about your stupid political opinions when you haven't voted. Keep your mouth shut. Hollywood. That's the here you go. For the YouTube moms in Hollywood. It's some clown. Well, I played a doctor on TV and I'm, and nobody cares, dude. I vote because men and women for the past two hundred years, two hundred plus, have gone out, picked up rifles, and fought and died for this country. That's why I vote because they can't. So I encourage you to vote. Now, you say, Gabby, man, no, I'm ecstatic. What a great day. Anita, honey, again, congratulations. Southeastern Guide Dogs, man, I hope this is the start of a good partnership. Trey Edenfield, 
I've got some uh, a video coming for you, son, uh, on some K-bars, and Trey sent me some info. Uh, you may have to send that back to me about another veterans group. Um, let me do this. There's a guy on YouTube that, that I'm a big fan of, and I watch a lot of YouTube. I'm going to put his link in the description below. But this guy, and I want to make sure I get his name right real quick. This guy summed up or, or, or firmed up me buying a um, Microtech. The guy's a professional shooter, and his, his video channel, his, his YouTube channel is X-Ring. He's the reason that um, I went ahead, I bought Hunter, I bought my son a uh, Microtech LUDT last year. I'm gonna buy him a uh, Ultratech this year. Now, watching this guy, I don't think he has anything to do with, with Microtech, I don't think he's employed by him. He's a professional shooter, and you know how YouTube is, there's big school marms over there, oh, you can't shoot guns. So he does a lot of knife reviews, he's very clear, He's very concise. I've never talked to the dude. Uh, I, and he's got like 50,000 subscribers. He's a big channel. But he's the reason uh, that I bought this. Go over there, man. Some of his torture tests he does on knives. Y'all think I'm hard on stuff? Woo wee, son. Mm. That dude gets it done. Y'all gonna have to pardon me one second. Got the old Molan LeBay there. Cut my goodies powder open. Now, because I'm super smart and made wise choices in my in my younger years uh, and decided to do a ton of drugs. I've lost most of my damn teeth. So when it rains and stuff like that, we do a little goodies powder. Does it help? I don't know. But listen, American Made Badassery, Veterans American Made, X-Ring, go check him out. Hey, I, I never had a conversation with a guy. I just maybe put, hey man, Choir Boys Cutlery sent us. He loves you. You know, that kind of thing. Here's my Microtech Molon LeBay. And I've watched about 20 videos. When you, man, it ain't my Molon LeBay. Shut up. Some... Southern grind. Oh, you know, I was chicken fried. Little American badassery, son. Got that little fox on the back there. Handle. Man, I love that handle. Y'all see that, like, pistol grip? Pow, pow. Right there, son. Golly, look at that. That is a gorgeous knife. American made, son. What are we coming on now? Woo-wee! The paramilitary two. American made. Let me show you where this one's going. I'm, this is kind of an EDC video, so I'm, I'm getting ready to go meet, uh, meet, eat, and retreat. Right there. Hey, CQC7, son. Work horse. You can't even call it a horse, it's a horse. In the pocket. Molon Lebe. If nothing else, it makes me look really cool hanging out around gas stations. Right there, what I got in this pocket. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Woo! Little less jaw action. Let me let me back it out here where you can get one of them long range looks at it, son. The ZT is in effect. Yes, it's in my pocket. Yes, I'm taking it today. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. Now, I gotta I gotta I gotta make some choices here. As uh, George Jones, I made a choice. So it's a wonder I didn't sign a contract saying, well, I got a good reason why. Y'all seen this? Watch here. I'm going to walk out of the room. Now watch. Incredible. All right. I got some choices to make. Since about three people watch this video, I, I'm not going to have y'all help me. I'll be an old man. Now, y'all know what this is. Y'all know what this is. This is the Miller. That's right. This is just sheer American mate. Dude's name's Steve Miller, not the singer. I don't think he is. I think me and Kirk and Good's gonna go take a ride probably in January 
and go go see Mr. Miller's new shop. Maybe do an interview. Man, that's beautiful. Woo! Get you excited, son. 50-year-old man getting all fired up in here. Now, Case Wankler. Son. Hey, one thing I did not do, and, and y'all know that I'm probably the world's worst knife reviewer. I didn't show you all the sheath because I had it on the other day. This is that black leather. And like I said, it's form-fitted inside. It's got, now let me tell you what I like about it. It's called that SE, that SE PR4 did this same thing. See that low ride like that? This is a good Sunday go to meeting knife. You know, when digging get out of hand, you just stab them real quick. You know, or when, you know, taking up money, somebody don't put enough, yeah, old lady don't put enough money in play, you say, hey. Let's go, let's end up, get it in there. But this is beautiful, beautiful knife, beautiful, beautiful sheath. Uh, Mr. Mr. Winkler case, uh, Kevin Holland, man, great job, guys. Love this. I, I, some people bitched about this, dude. Now, I am going to have to make a Kydex sheath for this, not because I don't like the sheath. This is seriously like, I went out to birthday dinner or birthday lunch for mom and dad, and I carried this knife. Um, just gorgeous, but I got to make it. Kydex because of the humidity. Well, I can't have a video, I'm gonna go ahead and shut this thing down. I can't have a video uh, about 22 veterans a day uh, or the military or anything like that without bringing out the granddaddy of them all. When you, when you say American made, when you say United States military, when you say any of that and all that stuff, you have to throw this in the conversation the K bar. That blade shape right there now, I have one with the leather rings and all that. It's over, I'm, I'm getting another Kydex sheath made. It's over at Dory's. Um, we're using that to practice on. This is the regular, this, is the, the, this isn't the big brother. This is the seven inch fighting knife. It is not the dog's head utility. Don't leave me a mess. Last time I did one, you just don't you don't even know. It's not. I know that I, or Kirk, cut the back guard off. Gives it a little bit different look, a little bit different feel. I love this knife. Now, Donnie B all day, D-Bad, has got a version coming out, a uh, thick tang. It's, um, man, I don't wanna, I'm not gonna say the name of it cause I, I'm gonna mess it up, it's war something. I've got my D-Bad D-Guard buoy coming. Um, now I find out the Nepalese are over there festivaling for a week. I'm like, dude, really? Just, can we just finish my knife? Wait, I mean, make it a party, you know, come in and do Samba, hit, hit it, just, let's get it out. Y'all know I love y'all. They're actually, y'all believe this or not, uh, the Kikri House is subscribed to this channel. They probably greatly regret it, but but they're subscribed to this channel. So guys, I love y'all. Hope you have a great week of festivaling and partying. Let's go ahead and get old Scab's knife out. Love y'all. God bless you. Hey, well, that's going to do it. Again, last time, Nita, congratulations, sweetheart. To every single last subscriber that I have, man, I love y'all. God bless y'all. Uh, I hope you have a great weekend. The one thing that you need to remember beyond anything else is this. Well, remember this for me. Share this video. I'm begging, please, share it on your Facebook. 22 veterans a day. Before I die, I want that number. I, and I, I could fall out tomorrow. But I want that to be my life's goal and mission is to get that to zero, okay? It, it, we have to make a stand on something and this is where I'll make my stand. So veterans, man, I ain't seen what you've seen. But I know this, if, if you're contemplating ending it, know this, somebody loves you. Somebody cares about you. We care. You fought for us, let us fight for, it, for you. Let us carry that burden. Hey, remember this too. This may be uh, the only time you hear me say it today, but I doubt it. I'm scab. You're not. We gone.